Here we are, Matthew Russell Lee, Inner City Press, here in Foley Square. It's Friday, June 30th. We're covering the court, and we're also covering Sam Bankman-Fried and some other related cases. We're going to contrast. Let's compare and contrast. This week, Sam Bankman-Fried's many motions to dismiss were denied, but he's scored an enormous victory in getting giving the Bahamas a right to veto some of the charges against him, including Chinese bribery. But what we want to compare is the trial on this first bunch of charges seems to be in October, and that's not getting moved. He's out, but he's getting a relatively speedy trial. Let's contrast that to Miles Guo. Miles Guo, charged with wire fraud, crypto fraud, won. He's jailed. He's detained. The government pursued it and, and won that order. But two, he said, fine, I'm jailed. I want, a, I want a trial in August. I want a speedy trial. And the government said, no, no. And the judges said, no, no, no. It's got to be April. So what happened to the Speedy Trial Act? That's a question that we will pursue. Inner City Press, to be continued.